Isaiah Tucker. Glory to God. I just want to greet our pastor, Pastor Calvin Tucker. I greet you, Pastor Calvin, in the name of Jesus. Just want to greet all you leaders. Just want to greet the members of this ministry. Just want to greet the community. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Just want to greet our Facebook friends today. Glory to God. I greet you all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Of, our, of Nazareth, our soon coming King. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. I just want to bless your holy name. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. You know, today, let's please turn your Bible with me to Psalm 103. Glory to God. And we're just going to talk about the mercies of God today. Hallelujah, Jesus. And as I listen to the songs that were being played, glory to God. I'm talking about the mercies of God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. The scripture lesson today, the Bible reading, all talking about the mercies of God. Because indeed we are wrapped up and tied up in the mercies of God. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Psalm 103. Glory to God. Verses 17 to 18. Hallelujah, Jesus. We will be looking at the entire chapter today, but I just want to read it for our text. Verse 17 to 18. Hallelujah, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. I worship the Lord. And it says that, but the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting upon them that fear him and his righteousness unto children's children, to such as keep his covenant, and to those that remember his commandments to do them. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. I am here today all because of the mercies of God. And you are here today all because of the mercies of God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. When you think of God's mercy, you automatically think about grace. Hallelujah, Jesus. Many people get the two mixed up. Glory to God. Although they are close in meaning, they are not the same thing. Hallelujah, glory to God. Come on and worship him. Thank you, minister. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Come on and worship him. Come on and worship him. Come on and worship him. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Does anybody here know about the mercies of God? Hallelujah, Jesus. Do you know about the mercies of God? Hallelujah, Jesus. Sometimes when I look at people, glory to God, looking all so cute, dressing up so nicely. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Nothing is wrong with that. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. But do you know, are you aware that it is the mercies of God why we are here? Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Grace. What is grace? Grace is God's unmerited favor. We don't deserve it. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And it goes beyond mercy. Mercy is God not giving us the punishment that we deserve for our sins. So that is the difference between grace and mercy. Glory to God. Grace goes way beyond mercy. Hallelujah, glory to God. It is by grace through faith why we are saved. Hallelujah, glory to God. It is not anything that we have done or could ever do. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God, hallelujah. Your neighbor will give you a plate of dinner or a night dinner. And they will tell you that they are serving the Lord. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus, glory to God. Nothing is wrong with giving somebody some dinner. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God, but we are saved by grace through faith. That's all. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus, glory to God, hallelujah. So giving somebody something doesn't mean that you are saved. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus, glory to God. There is nothing that we could do or ever do, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. 
Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to God, to be saved. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus, of to save us. Glory to God, hallelujah. Come on and worship God today. Come on and lift him up today. Come on and give him praise today, hallelujah. Hallelujah, glory to God. It is grace. When you wake up this morning, you think how you wake up yourself? Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus, glory to God, hallelujah. It is grace and it is mercy why we are alive this morning, glory to God, hallelujah. The songwriter said that his mercy kept me. Glory to God, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, hallelujah. Oh, glory to God, I just want to worship the Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and all that he has done for me, Glory to God when I look back. Uh, Lord God Almighty of where we brought me from, how we brought me here. Glory to God from a mighty long way. Glory to God, I have to worship him. I have to praise him. I have to give him thanks. Uh, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, glory to God. I can never ever repay the debt that I owe. Glory to God, hallelujah. Put up your hands today. Which one of you in here can repay the debt that you owe? Glory to God, hallelujah. We all owe our debt today. Glory to God, hallelujah. And debt, glory to God that none of us, none of us can ever, ever, ever repay. Glory to God, hallelujah. No matter how much work you do, glory to God, hallelujah. No matter how much dinner you give your neighbor, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. You can never, ever repay the debt that you owe. Glory to God, hallelujah. Romans 3 and verse 23 tells us that we all have sinned before a holy God. Lord God Almighty, and fall short of his glory. Oh, glory to God, hallelujah. Romans 6 and verse 23 tells us that the wages of sin is dead. Glory to God, hallelujah. The wages of sin is dead. The wages of sin is dead. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, mighty God of Daniel. The price of flour gone up. Electricity bills gone up. Water bill gone up. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus, glory to God. School fees gone up. Rent gone up, mortgage gone up. Hallelujah, Jesus. Right now, some people are crying. They don't even know what to do with themselves. Every day you're here. Glory to God. Oh, me have a manager. Lord God Almighty. The children must go to school. Glory to God. The rent is due. This and that. Oh, me have a manager. Lord God Almighty. What can I tell you? Glory to God. Hallelujah. Sinners do not know how they're going to manage. Lord God Almighty. But I know. I know how I'm going to manage. Glory to God, hallelujah. Glory to God, hallelujah. We are managing Jesus Christ. We are managing Jesus Christ. Oh, glory to God, hallelujah. Glory to God. When sinners cannot manage, and they don't know how to manage, glory to God, hallelujah. You must look to the hell from whence commit your help. Oh, glory to God. Lord Jesus, Psalm 121 tells us that our help comes from God. Lord God Almighty, look to the hell. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Come on and worship him. 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 Glory to God. Hallelujah. Look to Jesus, who is the author and the finish of your faith. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. I am looking to God. My faith is in him. My trust is in him. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Lord Jesus, from the other day, Lord God Almighty, this is what is keeping me. Though he slay me, Lord God Almighty, yet will I trust him. Jesus, though you slay me, God, yet will I trust you. My faith is in you. My trust is in you. Mighty God of Daniel, Jesus, Jesus. Glory to God. 
Avenue when it boils down to the nitty gritty. This is what it's all. It is all about my faith is in God. My trust is in God. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. If you don't get to a place where your trust is in God, where your faith is in God, if you don't get to a place where nothing will shake you, if you don't get to a place where you will be like a palm tree, Lord God Almighty, when storm comes and hurricane comes, the palm tree will dip and it will dip. Oh, glory to God, hallelujah. Glory to God, hallelujah. But the palm tree remains firmly rooted and grounded in God. It doesn't matter what you want to do to me, God. My faith is in you. My trust is in you. Oh, glory to God. Though you slay me, God, yet will I trust you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Nothing else matters. Do you hear the beautiful actions? Nothing else matters. Glory to God. If you don't have a shoes to put on your feet to come to the church of God, I tell you, you better come anyway. Lord God Almighty, oh glory to God. If you don't have clothes to wear and you have a sheet, Lord God Almighty, you better wrap up in it. Lord God Almighty, I say you better wrap up in it. Glory to God. Get some pins. Lord God Almighty, you don't know what I'm talking about. Sheet, borrow one sheet, wrap up yourself, pin it up, come to the church of Almighty God and worship Him. Let me hear you worship Him. Let me hear you worship Him. I don't care what you don't have. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. I don't care what you have or what you don't have. to pay my fear to do some witness. 
said, don't you think God is going to provide? Hallelujah. Don't you think God is going to show up? Hallelujah. He's going to show up because you want to go. He's going to show up because he knows that souls are out there dying. And God wants his people to be saved. Don't you think he's going to show up? gonna show up. Hallelujah! Come on and worship him. 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 Worship God today. We are not here because of how cute we look. Hallelujah, Jesus. We are not here to dress up and powder up, Lord God Almighty. That is not why we are here. Oh, glory to God. If you think that is why you are here, then you lose the vision. Glory to God, hallelujah. You are visionless. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Do you think that you are here to get a nice job and to work and to feed your, your family? Oh, glory to God, hallelujah. That is not why you are here. Oh, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, glory to God, mighty God of Daniel. You are here to serve him. You are here to serve him. You are here to serve him. No matter the cost. Hallelujah, Jesus. It doesn't matter the cost. When it comes on to Jesus, it doesn't matter the cost. Oh, glory to God. I can hear somebody giving their testimony. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Lord God Almighty, we are talking about the mercies of God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Somebody testify. Oh, glory to God. And says that I have a brother and I love them so much. Oh, glory to God. Lord Jesus, my brother was at a particular place and gunman struck and fired some shots. Oh, glory to God. And my brother, oh, glory to God, was shot up and he died. Glory to God. And somebody says, oh, glory to God. When I ask Jesus, glory to God, why Jesus, why Jesus, why you have to let my brother die? I love him so much, so, so, so much. Lord Jesus, I can't live without him. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. I bless the name of Jesus. Come on and worship him, somebody. Come on and worship him, somebody. Come on and worship him, somebody. Somebody worship him. Somebody worship him. Somebody worship him. Oh, glory to God. Why, Jesus? Why did you have to let my brother die? Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. And when God did not answer, oh, glory to God. Lord Jesus, oh, glory to God. The person begin to manage God. Did you hear what I say? Did you hear what I just say? Hallelujah, Jesus. I'm talking about somebody. Glory to God. Hallelujah. That is saved. That has given their heart to the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. And when God did not answer the person, glory to God. Hallelujah. Begin to manage God. Because they just couldn't understand. Why, God? Why? You choose to take my brother from me. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And they managed God for months. And God still not saying anything. You hear what I said? Because the glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Sometimes we think that God has to answer us. God not to answer us. Glory to God. God is not obligated to none of us. Glory to God. God is God. We have to understand. 
understand that God is God and whatever God wants to do, he will do. So you may have a lot of questions to ask God. But God may not choose to answer them. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Because sometimes we want to answer from God. And we want to tell God how to answer. But I have news for you today. God may not answer the way you want him to answer. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And the man is God for months. And one day, God decided to answer. And God said, Now, where were you? When my son was being nailed to the cross. That's what God asked him. Where were you? I am sure, so, so sure, that that was not the answer that he was looking for. Uh -huh. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. God said, where were you? You remember when Jesus hung on that cross? All the disciples run away and leave him. Every single one of them. And if we were there, we would have done the same thing. Don't tell me nothing less. Hallelujah, Jesus. That's what we would have do, done. Glory to God. Run away and leave him. And if that was not enough before he went to the cross, he, he said to his disciples, just watch with me. That's all. He said, just watch with me for about an hour. Did they watch with him? Answer me, church. Did they watch with him? No. No. They were sleeping. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. So God will not answer you the way sometimes you want him to answer. Just like he will not come to on your timing. He will come to when he wants to come to. When he sees fit to answer. We're talking about God here. He's not obligated to none of us. And a lot of times we think that, you know, we know God. Hallelujah. To the point where we can boast him out. Jinali. He has to do what we want to do. We want him to do rather. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. But God is not like that. God asked him, where were you when my son hung on that old rugged cross for the sins of the whole world? The songwriter says, he knew me. He knew you. Jesus. He knew us even before you went to the cross. From before the foundation of this world, God knew us. But he still went to the cross. And he died and he suffered there. Not because of anything that he did. Glory to God. Hallelujah. But because of the sins that you and I committed. And he's still doing today. Glory to God. Because we all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Now God has to punish us. 
and some people will not take kindly to this. Because some people kill them dead. God don't punish nobody. God will never kill nobody. God will not do nothing of the sort. God has to punish us. How do you feel when someone committed a crime against you? Your children, your family, etc. How do you feel? I don't know. But I know how I feel at times. Glory to God. Hallelujah. At times you want to get evil. You want them to die. I heard you say something. You want to spy them. That's, that's what the pastor said. You want to do some spiting. That's all. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. That is how we feel. Can you imagine? Glory to God. I was listening to a testimony the other day. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I think it was Brother Paul who sent me that testimony. A lady was testifying about how they wanted to rape her daughter. And she sent away her daughter. Glory to God. Because she got word or get word that they wanted to rape her daughter. And we're talking about a Christian woman here. Hallelujah, glory to God. And she decided to send away her daughter. Glory to God, hallelujah. And she decided to say she had her son. Glory to God, hallelujah. And when they came for the daughter, the daughter was not there. And they come to bed, they come to mattress, and look underneath there to see if the daughter was under the, under the bed, hiding. And when they looked everywhere and they couldn't find the daughter, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah. The God man point the gun at the son's head and just fire a shot. Glory to God. And his morals, brilliant, fly out. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. We bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God. And then they proceeded to shock the mother. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. That is how the enemy is. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. He comes to steal. He comes to rob from us. Hallelujah. Glory to God. He comes to destroy. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Come on and just worship him. Just worship him. Just worship him. Just worship him. Hallelujah, glory to God. But before the devil strike, God would have put that mother and that son in a frame of mind. Glory to God, he would have prepared them for what would have happened to them. Glory to God, hallelujah. It is very important for God to prepare you. <laughs> you know, before my son passed off, God prepared me. Yes, the pain will come because I'm a human being and all of that. And you will remember Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. But when God prepares you for something, it means that you don't have to worry, you don't have to fret. Glory to God, hallelujah. It means that, glory to God, you are prepared. Hallelujah, Jesus. It means that you are in a frame of mind to receive. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. We bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God will prepare you from time to time. What? He knows that he's going to take you through. He has a test for you. He's going to prepare you to pass that test. Hallelujah. Glory to God. It must be you who don't want to pass that test. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But God has a way of preparing us. For what we will go through. Glory to God. Hallelujah.
Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes, I cried. Hallelujah. When I have to cry, Hallelujah, Jesus. If I don't to cry, I don't cry. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. It is very important. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When God prepare you because he will give you the strength to go through. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Some persons, when you're going through some stuff, persons will wonder how you go through that. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. We bless the name of Jesus, but it is not you. It wasn't I. It is not I. Glory to God. It is Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You see, it is not about me. Hallelujah. Glory to God. It is all about Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. Come on and worship him. 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 Yes, at times, I will need to be strengthened. Glory to God. I may need that shoulder to cry on. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. But when you understand that it is not about you, it is all about Jesus. Glory to God. Jesus will take some stuff from you. He will take some people from you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. It is all about his glory. It is not about you. It is about Jesus. Doesn't matter what Jesus wants to take you through. Some stuff that He will take you through, you will not understand. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You will not understand at that point in time. Glory to God. But after you will understand. Hallelujah, Jesus. I am here to tell you that you will understand. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. So be prepared. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Because it's going to take some stuff from you. Hallelujah, Jesus. It's going to take some loved ones from you. And what are you going to do? You're going to give up? Hallelujah. What are you going to do? You're going to turn the towel? Hallelujah. Glory to God. You're going to turn your back on Jesus? What are you going to do? Think about it. Just think about it. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Think about it. If you have one son, if you have one daughter, and God decides to take that one child, what are you going to do? Are you going to say, God, I this? Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. We worship you, Lord. Come on and worship him. 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 We are talking about God's mercy today. It is God's mercy while you are here. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. When someone do you something, when they commit a crime against you, you want them to pay. So it is when we committed a crime against God, we have to pay. Glory to God. No sin, go and punish. And it doesn't matter what you did wrong. Glory to God, hallelujah. We all have to pay. Some will not pay and some don't pay. We all have to pay. As humans, we desire mercy. We desire mercy. We desire love. We desire all of those things. But are we willing to give love? Are we willing to give mercy? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Are we willing to be faithful to God? Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
Come on and worship him. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Should we receive mercy? I'm asking a question today. Should we receive mercy from God? Should we receive mercy from God? And the answer is no. We don't deserve it. We don't deserve God's mercy. We don't deserve his love. As a matter of fact, we don't deserve nothing from God. Hallelujah, Jesus. For God's mercy is bigger than any mistake you have ever made or could ever make. Some of us, we have made some mistakes in our lives. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I don't know about you, but when I just come to God and I sin, I didn't want to ask God for mercy. I didn't want to, I didn't want to go before God. Hallelujah, because I feel guilty. Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to God. I feel dirty, I feel messy. Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to God. But as I begin to grow and grow in God, I realize that, and as I go, hallelujah, Jesus, I realize that mercy is at the foot of the cross. Hallelujah, Jesus. And once you go to God and you repent of your sins, you're sorry for what you have done. You glory to God and you say, Jesus, forgive me. He's ready to forgive you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. And Psalm 111 verse 4 says, He is full of compassion. It is interesting how often when we relate to God, we are not really sure who God is. We think we know. But let me tell you something. God is not part mercy. God is mercy. God is not part love. God is love. God is not part faithful. God is faithful. God is mercy. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. God is everything mercy could ever be and hope to be. He is that kind of a Lord to us. And I am sure I am glad. All I may be glad. Be glad. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. God is full of compassion. Psalm 119 says that. Psalm 119 and the verse 64 says that. The earth, O oh Lord, is full of mercy. The earth, O oh Lord, is full of your mercy. Psalm 119 and verse 156 says that Great are your mercies, O God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Psalm 145 and verse 8 says that The Lord is gracious and full of compassion. He's great in mercy. Come on and worship Him. Somebody just worship Him. When you understand that you are here and it is all because of God's mercy, come on and worship Him today. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. We worship you, mighty God of Daniel. Oh, glory to God. The good news of the gospel is who God is. And God is love. Hallelujah, Jesus. We already know who we are and what we are. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. We also like to say, if we knew what was in the heart of the next person, we would move. Glory to God, hallelujah. If I could ever read some people's mind, hallelujah, Jesus, what they're thinking about me. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. I know. Hallelujah, glory to God. Before I reach the stage, I know that I would have backslid. I would have backslid. I took my thought. Hallelujah, Jesus. Because some things that people are thinking about us are so pretty. Glory to God, hallelujah. But what but that is not really important. What we really should what we really want to know or what we really should know is about God's grace and God's mercy. And mercy is what God is. There is never a moment when you come to the Lord and He stops being merciful. Hallelujah, glory to God. We worship the Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. Now, that is not always true of people. 
even now and then you run into somebody who say, hallelujah, has real compassion and care. Glory to God. They are merciful. Some people like to tell you that I am merciful, I am this, I am that. But every now and again, glory to God, hallelujah, you get the shock of your life. Hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah. Because they are not merciful. Glory to God. And some are more and more occasions they are not merciful. Even the best among us who major in mercy, who major in compassion, can at certain moments not have it. But if we lack mercy, there is a gift, a spiritual gift, the Bible says, of showing mercy. Mercy is a gift. Showing mercy is a gift. So if we don't have that gift today, or this gift today, we can ask for God, and God will give us the gift of mercy. Hallelujah, glory to God. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God, come on and worship him. 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 Worship him. Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hebrews 4, 4 and verse 6 tell us that, glory to God, the throne of grace. Hallelujah. Glory to God, there is a throne of grace where we may obtain mercy and find grace in, in, in time of need. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. He knows what we are like. Glory to God, hallelujah. He knows we are not worth much. Glory to God, hallelujah. We are not worth much. We are nothing. We are nothing. Glory to God, hallelujah. No care how we pump on his flesh. Hallelujah, and dress it up and powder it. We are nothing before God. Nothing at all. God said that he knows our frame, that they are frail, they are weak. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. We are not good. We are not good. Some people like to tell you that I am good. Hallelujah, Jesus. Only God good. We are not good. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. There is none that understand. That is what the word of God says. There is none that understand. Glory to God. We are thieves. We are murderers, liars, fornicators, adulterers, biters. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We are gamblers, extortioners. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Jesus. You know what Isaiah 64 and verse 6 said? We are our sin. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Let me repeat that. We are all as an unclean thing. That is what it is saying. We are all as an unclean thing. Hallelujah, Jesus. And all our righteousness. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Are as filthy rods. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God, hallelujah. So you think that you are good? Hallelujah, this is what we are. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Sometimes, hallelujah, when I come into Spanish town, I can tell you what sin is all about. We bless the name of Jesus, glory to God. When I come into Spanish town from time to time, glory to God. And when I look at the streets in Spanish town, oh, they are filthy. Hallelujah, Jesus. The business operators just throw out them garbage in the street. We bless the name of Jesus. When you look into the gutters, hallelujah, Jesus, glory to God. The gutters are black and slimy. All kinds of things pop up in the gutters in Spanish town. Glory to God, hallelujah. A perfect example of what sin is all about. Glory to God, hallelujah. Sin is nasty. Sin is slimy. Sin is dirty. Glory to God, hallelujah. Sin is not something to be hugging up. Hallelujah, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on and worship God. Come on and worship God. If you know what I'm talking about today, give God a mighty praise up in here. Sin is nasty. It is slimy. But has it not been for the mercy of God? Some of us, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. We are coming from some place over yonder. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. We don't even want to be identified with our past. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. 
Glory to God, hallelujah, because some of us, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus, we were thieves and robbers and shocking up, hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah. We were everything, glory to God, hallelujah. When we come now and look back, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus, we detest our past life. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. But guess what? It is our testimony. Our messes are our testimonies. Yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I remember. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When I come to Jesus. Before I come to Jesus, I was shocking up. And after I come to Jesus, guess what? I'm still in a shock up. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Shock up. Hallelujah, Jesus. We bless the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I want to tell somebody today that sin, sin is nice. You don't believe me? They say sin is nice. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Jesus. Sin is nice. Somebody said to the flesh. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But when you come to God, and you look back at some of the things that you used to do. Glory to God. You seek your stomach. Hallelujah, Jesus. Come on, man. And even now, some of us, we're still doing some things that seek stomach. Yes. I told me a talk. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Yes. But had it not been for God, mercy. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We would not have been here today. Glory to God. Some of us, every minute, we have to be running to God. God have mercy. God have mercy. God, me tired of this. Me still I do it. Lord God Almighty. But God, me know that it is wrong. And I want to get rid of it, God. Deliver me, Jesus, from this. To me, talk. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Lord Jesus, so sin is nice to the flesh. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. One time I tell somebody, say, you know, that's it nice. She said, no, man, it's nice. Yeah. So if sin is not nice yeah. to the flesh, why are that people is not in Christendom? Yeah. Why? <laughs> why a lot of people is not in the kingdom of God? Why? It's because sin is nice to the flesh. Glory to God, hallelujah. They cannot afford to put the sin aside. Glory to God, hallelujah, because it is nice to them. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. But guess what? The wages of sin is dead. Glory to God, hallelujah. Hallelujah. It have a my God, as I can be said, as a high price. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. A very, very high price. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Come on and worship God, somebody. Hallelujah. Come on and worship God, somebody. Hallelujah. Come on and worship God, somebody. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are talking about the mercies of God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. It is the mercies of God why we are not consumed. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Psalm 103 and verse 2. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Hallelujah, Jesus. And forget not all his benefits. Do not forget the benefits of God. Do not ever, ever forget the things that God has done for you. Some of us, we are so ungrateful. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. It is his mercy that makes all his benefits possible. And God, mercy. Hallelujah, Jesus, because we don't deserve it. So it is his mercy. Hallelujah. Why? It is possible. And verse 3 says that who forgives, who heals. Verse 4 says that who redeems, who crowns. Verse 5 says that who satisfies. Glory to God. It is just one verb after another telling you about the benefits of our Lord. It is God who is merciful, who provides healing, forgiveness, redemption. He crowns us and satisfies us. God does it all because he's a merciful God. Yes. It is nothing about you and I. And nothing about us. Hallelujah. Why God shows us mercy and continues to show us mercy. 
Psalm 103 verse 8 to 9 says that the Lord is merciful and gracious, slow to anger. Glory to God. And you know what I'm talking about. This is all about patience. God is so patient with us. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. You know, sometimes when we come to God, you know, we want God to be patient with us. But we don't want God to be patient with the sinners. We want God to be patient with us, but we don't want God to be patient with nobody else. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. But aren't you glad God does not fly off the handle like some of us? Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Some simple little things at times, and we get mad. We get angry. Hallelujah, Jesus. Have you grown up in a home where maybe one or more of the parents had a bad temper? Anybody can be identified with this? And when you did something wrong as a child, all of a sudden you just hear wham! Oh, glory to God. In my times, our parents get angry with us because we are not living up to their expectations. And this is not the character of God. Hallelujah, Jesus. God is never angry at people. Be angry at the sins that we are committing. Hallelujah, glory to God. Come on and just worship God today. Hallelujah. Come on and just worship Him today. Hallelujah. Come on and just worship Him today. God is long suffering. He's angry. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. And what we do, yes, He's angry at what we do. Hallelujah, the wrong that we do. Glory to God, hallelujah. And we are to be angry at sin too. Glory to God, hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. When you're angry at sin, you're not sin. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. God, we just want to worship you today. Father, we just want to give you praise today. We just want to worship you. Come on and worship him. Hallelujah, hallelujah Jesus. Glory to God, hallelujah, glory to God. Just want to thank you, Lord, for your mercy towards me. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. God's mercy also involves his punishment. Believe it or not. When God does punish us for our sins, you must understand that it is done in mercy. So whenever time you are being punished by God, it is being done in mercy, in love. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. If God would punish you according to what you really deserve, you would be in big trouble. Hallelujah, Jesus. The Bible says in verse 10 that he has dealt with us according to our sins. Sorry, he has not dealt with us. Let me correct myself there. He has not dealt with us according to our sins nor punish us according to our iniquity. Thank you, Pastor. I hear Pastor behind me. No. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Pastor. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Because we are all here to correct each other. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And if we can take correction, the sorry for us. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. God knows exactly everything that we have done, said our thought. And the Bible says in Hebrews 4 verse 13 that all things are naked and open unto the eyes of him with whom we have been. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Everything is open and naked before God. Everything that we do, glory to God. Our life is an open book before God. Hallelujah, Jesus. We cannot hide from God. Glory to God. Jeremiah 17 verses 9 to 10 says, The heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked. Glory to God. Who can know it? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. I will always remember Pastor Calvin for this scripture. He always, glory to God, reminding us that the heart is deceitful. Glory to God, hallelujah, above all things, and desperately wicked. And the question is asked, who can know it? 
Glory to God. Hallelujah. It is I, the Lord, that searches the reins of the heart. God knows us in a way that we don't even know ourselves. Hallelujah, Jesus. Lamentation 3 verse 22 says that it is of the Lord's mercy that we are not consumed because his passions fail not. His compassions fail not. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Every morning, his mercies, they are new. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is his mercy towards those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, we're still in Psalm 103. So far has he removed our transgressions from us. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. I just want to bless your holy name, mighty God. Father God, I just want to give you praise. I just want to give you glory, Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us and to cleanse us from all our unrighteousness. That is 1 John 1 and verse 9. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Forgiveness is rooted in the character of God. And that is why we are saved. God is merciful to us. And no matter how gross you are, or how you have messed up, or blown your brain and life away, glory to God, hallelujah. God's character is limitless. Hallelujah. No matter how much sin is in your life, where sins abound, grace did much more abound, Romans 5 and verse 20. Glory to God, hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Psalm 86 and verse 5 says, For you, O Lord, Hallelujah, Jesus. I good and ready to forgive. And abundant in mercy to all those who call upon your name. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. So none of us don't have to go to hell. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. God, make a way. Glory to God. Hallelujah. There is a way that we can repent and turn from our sins. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Having mercy is good. Having no mercy is dangerous. God will judge those who refuse to show mercy and hold a grudge against others. Mercy is something that I have struggled with in my walk of faith. And maybe you have struggled or are still struggling. Glory to God. I remember being mad at people because of things they, do, they did to me. But when I come to realize that I have hurt people, I have hurt people too. Glory to God. We have all hurt people. Sometimes you know and sometimes you don't. Hallelujah, glory to God. We bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. And that is why we have to be merciful. And if we don't have mercy, we need to ask God to give us mercy. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. But you know what? I ask the Lord to forgive me where I could have made amends and move on. Glory to God, hallelujah. We often get mad at our children for having to teach them something over and over. Yes, it's true. So true. Even right now, in the body of Christ, when leaders have to be telling somebody over and over and over and over and over and over, don't put that dear son, put it over dear son. Don't do that that way. Do it this way. Sometimes people get angry. Hallelujah, glory to God. We worship you, mighty God of Daniel. Hallelujah, glory to God. Yes, Lord. The same things that we get angry at people for, we do at times. Hallelujah, glory to God. Hallelujah. It never happened to you yet? Yes. It never happened to nobody up in here? Yes. Hallelujah, Jesus. The same things that we get mad with people about. <laughs> It's the same thing. Yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We do. 
Glory to God. Hallelujah. We bless the name of Jesus. But we are too prideful to see it. But before God, we have done even worse things. Yes. <laughs> Mighty God of Daniel, Father God, I just thank you now. God, I really thank you for your mercy. I really thank you for your mercy. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Ah, <laughs> oh, Jesus. Just like God has shown us mercy. Hallelujah. And continue to show us mercy. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Just worship him today. Just worship God today. I'm coming down, man. Hallelujah, glory to God. But we have to talk about the mercies of God. Because sometimes we think that it is all about us. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. It is not about God. That's how we behave at times. Like it is not about God. It is all about us. But glory to God. Hallelujah. Sometimes when I, you know, God has shown me some stuff where I'm coming from. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I can never ever be ungrateful. I can never ever be ungrateful to God and I can never ever be ungrateful to people. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Because we need each other now. We need each other on this earth. Glory to God, hallelujah. Some situations that you're gonna be in, you're gonna need people. Glory to God. Because I remember when I used to sleep. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. When I used to sleep at people's yard, glory to God, I remember that. Hallelujah, Jesus. And that is why I'm in another time for pop style for nobody. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Because if me have a pop style for nobody, I may sell me a pop style for and me a pop style for God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Because I remember when I used to sleep at people's yard. Glory to God, hallelujah. When my stepfather said, look here, you need to come out here. Hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. I may have to take people yard for it. People put me up. Glory to God, hallelujah. That is where I'm coming from. I remember. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. I remember a person by the name of Rosie. They put me up. And you know, before Rosie, before Rosie, before Rosie passed this life, I want to do something special for Rosie. I want to do something special. We must not be ungrateful. We must always remember where we're coming from. Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes, man. Don't scatter roses when people are gone. Give it to them now while they still carry on. Hallelujah, glory to God. Let them know what they did for you. Let them know how you appreciate them, how much you appreciate them doing what they did for you. Hallelujah, glory to God. So if it is your mother, your father, it doesn't matter who it is, appreciate those who have done something good for you. Glory to God, hallelujah. So yes, me so sleep. A people, yeah, sleep on a riverside. What a business now. But guess what? It's the same time that we never understand. But we understand now. Glory to God. That minute I've been sleep on a riverside. To where God is taking me. Hallelujah, glory to God. But I've been sleep on people, yeah. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Do a wide open. I'm a two children that must sleep, and then there are two children that will have a sleep and do a open wide. Young children and do a open wide. They light up their self sleep and they do a yes up and they do a open for a night 
till the morning. You get what I said? From night till the morning. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm talking about like three year old and four year old. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. So some of these things we have to go through. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. But when you're going through these things, you don't understand nothing. How you think that you are alien and God, why do I have to go through this? Why do I have to go up in a different family? Why this? Why that? Why that? Why that? So if you're going through some stuff today and you don't understand why. Why, 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 why? You soon understand why. Just be around a little bit. Just be around with Jesus a little bit. You soon understand why. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Matthew 18, verse 26 to 33, and we read about a particular person that owes some money. And the person couldn't pay the money. What if for money? And when the person couldn't pay the money, they beat the person, go to who they who and say, look here, I can't afford to pay the money here for my own. And the person said, all right. Have a right to have a debt. Never write it out. And some of us are like that. The poor people. And you cannot pay it. Lord of mercy, Jesus. And we go to the person. Sometimes I'm not even going to go to the person and the person find us. Yes. I'm going to make that about. including myself. We didn't know some money. This whole thing. Anybody up in there know what I'm talking about? Anybody? Amen. No, you're nobody. So I look like I'm the other one. And I remember. And I remember. Say so if you remember, shout it out, man. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. I remember who was some money for school fee. We didn't pay enough, but guess what? Sometimes in the know go, sometimes I can't pay the way I want to pay. And sometimes the thing gets stretched out. Glory to God, hallelujah. And one day I get a call. I remember it was a call together, I was here. And I was told that, you see those monies that you owe for school fee? God said, hey, you're not worth it. God cancel it. God write it out. Anybody up in here know what I'm talking about? We didn't know what's up school fee. Um, I'm ready to call. We didn't know school fee here. School fee. Right here on Beautiful Ashes. It's good to testify. Tell people, make people know what I want. And we had a warm time paying it. But we come at school the same way now. We come at school the same way. We were never told one day yet not to come to class. And one day, Apostle Marcia Tucker, she told us, I don't remember if it's because she called me on the phone or I was here, we were here. 
and she tell we were in a meeting or something. I think it was a meeting that we were in. And she told us that God said the school fee that you don't owe, we write it out. I mean, I tell about one person or two person. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. And God write it out. So if God write off our bills, if God can write off a bill, and some of us are just one bill God write off, man, and more than one bill, Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. But this person in the Bible, after God write off a bill, leave the presence of God and look up in somebody who, who I know, my God, <laughs> and decide to draw the upon the person for the money that the person who I and the person said, you know, I bet you know, just give me some little time to pay it. And the person get all boisterous and get angry and mad. I said, we need my money now, we need it now. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Never remember that in the poor, who are for money. And the amount of money where you are, you know, you are, you are, this, you are ascribing to billions of dollars today. Glory to God. And the next person just owe him a little bit of money. Just a little bit of money. And he refused from right to down. No mercy now. No mercy. So if anybody is here today like that, you need to stop it. mercy. Anybody watching, listening today, and you are like that, you need to stop it. God show us mercy, we need to show others mercy. Yes. And guess what? Because it didn't show the person mercy, guess what happened to him? Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. He was grabbed, not sure, and where he was put. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. He was put in red. Prison. Yeah. Prison. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. So if we refuse from showing mercy, that is exactly what is going to happen to us. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We're going to go in a prison. Hallelujah, Jesus. God, prison too. Glory to God. Spiritual prison. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And it's never nice. Hallelujah, Jesus, I'm coming down. I'm wrapping up. we are wrapping up. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. But Matthew 6 and verse 15 says that, but if you refuse to forgive others, your Father, your Heavenly Father, will not forgive you of your sins. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. And James 2 verse 13 says that, if you refuse from showing mercy, when it is your time, for persons to show you mercy, nobody is going to show you no mercy. Glory to God. You're going to, to reap what you sow. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah, glory to God. We are saved by His mercy and grace and not by anything we could have ever done. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Ephesians 2, verses 4 to 5. But because of His great love for us, God, who is rich in mercy, made us alive with Christ even when we were dead in transgressions. It is by grace we have been saved. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Never think that it is too late to get right with God. Glory to God. All of us who are not right with God, both out there and in here, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Do not ever think that it is too late to make it right with God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Mighty God of Daniel. Hallelujah, Jesus. We can never ever do anything. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 
for God not to show us mercy. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. You know what Billy Graham said? He said that God cannot clear the guilty until atonement is made. Mercy is what we need. That is what we receive at the foot of the cross. That is what Billy Graham says. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. God cannot clear the guilty until atonement is made. Max Luke Carter says that the difference between mercy and grace is that mercy gave the prodigal son a second chance. But grace gave him a feast. Remember that feast that he gets when Father put on for him when he come up? Yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. So mercy gave him a second chance. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And I would want to believe that he make use of him second chance. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. But grace gave him a feast that big brother did mine. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. So all the big brothers, they don't have to mind when people come back to Christ. Leave them alone. Glory to God. Rejoice with them. Hallelujah, Jesus. When Jesus died on the cross, the mercy of God did not come any greater. It could not become any greater, for it was already infinite. We get the notion that God is mercy or showing mercy because Jesus died. No, Jesus died because God is showing mercy. It was the mercy of God that gave us Calvary, not Calvary that gave us mercy. If God had not been merciful, there would, there would have been no incarnation. There would have been no baby in the manger, no man on the cross, and no open tomb. This is what the mercies of God did for us. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Romans 12 and verse 1 says that we are to present our bodies to God as a living sacrifice. Holy. So all those who have a problem with us living a holy life, then can go on. But we know God says that he's a holy God and we are to be holy. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. So we are to present ourselves as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable. Yes. Our sacrifice must be acceptable unto God. And what the end part says, it says that, which is our reasonable, a reasonable man. Glory to God, hallelujah. After all that God has done for us, it is more than reasonable, not so more than reasonable. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. And what it means to be a living sacrifice. It just simply means just to be obedient in everything that God said. Be obedient to God, that's what it means. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. I'm coming down. Are we troubled today? If we're troubled today, Understand that the Lord is merciful. Come to him for help. Whatever it is that you need. Whatever help you need. Whatever you need, whatever you need help for. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Come to God. He can help you because he is a merciful priest. Glory to God. Call upon him, man. Come to the throne of grace to find mercy in the time that we will need. Glory to God, hallelujah. Jesus, mercy. Come to God, man. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. Those who don't come to God yet, St. John 2 and verse 16 tells us that for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish. You don't have to perish. You don't have to perish. And all of us who is in the church, 
and he's playing anky panky one foot in and one foot out. You don't have to go to hell. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Jesus already paid the price that you might live. Luke 19 and verse 10 that says that for Jesus is come to seek and to save the lost. Hallelujah, glory to God. Come to Jesus, man. Hallelujah, glory to God. All those who are listening today, this community, glory to God, hallelujah. Jesus, come to God. Oh, glory to God. God is calling you from a life of sin. Glory to God, hallelujah, Jesus. He's a merciful God. Glory to God. He hates the sin that you are doing. But he loves you. He loves you so much. Enough to wait or to go to an old rugged cross. Hallelujah, Jesus. To die. That you might live and reign with him in heaven. What is your answer today? Glory to God. Now is the acceptable time. Hallelujah, Jesus. Today is the day of salvation. Glory to God. If you should hear his voice today, do not harden your heart. Do not stiffen your neck. So many people are doing that right now. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. But open up your hearts to Jesus today. Open up your hearts and let him in. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. He's knocking on your heart door. Oh, glory to God. Why don't you open up? Why don't you open up your heart and let him in? Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for mercy. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your love. Thank you for saving me, Lord. Thank you for saving me, Lord. Yeah.